in a world where drinks are too hard to make at home comes a bartender so lazy she won't make any drink with more than four ingredients. To all my booze drinking friends around the world, I solemnly swear on everything booze and anything wants to be booze that I have never made, nor sniffed, nor sipped any of these drinks. Kate Boyer is the lazy bartender. I can <laughs> Boyer as your lazy bartender, hear so declare and decree and d de all sorts of things, September 3rd as Aquavit International Day, from here on out. Not International Aquavit Day, but Aquavit International? <laughs> Is that your new company? You know, <laughs> this may not look like a big knife, or a very sharp one, but it can definitely do its job. It's my own little Swiss Army knife. Even though Aquavit is not from Switzerland, it's Scandinavian, and I have my Aquavit shirt on today to show how international I am. Okay, well, you may be asking yourself, what are we going to drink today with Aquavit? With Aquavit? <laughs> and I'm going to tell you this, it's called Sunrise Over the Fjord. And that is thanks to Vicra Distillery in Duluth, Minnesota, who makes Aquavit there. This shirt is from a distillery in Mo uh, Montana that makes Aquavit. Okay, let's get to it. So we have our Aquavit here chilled. We have our sparkling dry wine, and we have a Looks grapefruit. Wet to me. It, it's a little wet, but um, you know where it counts, it's dry. <laughs> but where it counts, it needs. Okay, we can go there. <laughs> okay, so what we need is an ounce of Aquavit. And we measure this puppy out. I have just about enough to make one of these drinks because I can't help myself. I love Aquavit and I just keep drinking it all. So get some ice to our shaker. We use our hands around here because we don't mind getting a little dirty. Throw in the Aquavit. And we use our handy dandy knife to cut our fresh grapefruit. Mmm, citrusy. Okay. Now we need one and a half ounces of grapefruit juice, but you know, I'm the lazy bartender and I'm just doing a good squeeze. A really good squeeze. This is maybe about a quarter of the grapefruit, I guess, you know, if you want to get technical. But, mm, give me a little nibble. Mmm. Mmm, grapefruit's good. Should have it more often. Okay, I think that's good. Then we're going to shake this puppy up. Now they say till it gets nice and chilled about 30 seconds. I don't know if we're gonna do 30 seconds. My hand's starting to get awfully cold. And you're lazy, so who wants to go 30 seconds? Well, yeah, and I don't even want to count to 30. So, okay. Now, simple as throwing it into your glass. Drip, drip, drip. I like to really get every last sip of goodness into my glass. Okay. Now this is where your sparkling white wine comes in. And you can, you know, if you have a a flute. You can just fill up the rest with that. And if you don't, just eyeball it. That's a good lazy bartender way. Okay, now let's try this puppy. All right. Now let's imagine that this drink is like sitting on a warm, white, sandy beach with turquoise blue ocean lapping just yards from your toes, digging into the soft wet sand. Surrounding you are men that have taken care of themselves, let's say. Nice tan and each one holding a tray of delicacies. 
and they each one step up to you after you take a sip. And they place their delicacy right in your mouth. That is what this drink is like. The grapefruit reaches you first. The sparkling white wine brings the light to your palate. And the aquavit, well, it just finishes everything off just right. Yeah, you're going to want this one again and again.